Hi, uh, this is just a quick little video to talk to you about the best time to strike a good deal on your energy contract. Uh, this is predominantly information geared toward business owners, both small and medium. Um, there's a thing in our industry that we refer to as the shoulder months. And with the start of fall, um, going all the way through the springtime, that is what we call the shoulder month. What that means as a consumer is that this is the best time for you to shop and negotiate your rates, even if your contract still has another year or a year and a half left before it expires. Energy, uh, natural gas, electricity, they are all purchased on the same rules that commodities are traded on. So that means you can buy all the energy that you're going to use for a period of up to, based on a certain approval guidelines, up to five years. You can lock your price today. So the reason that I felt it was important to make this one of my earlier videos is that uh, many of you may know that our nation is currently facing an energy crisis. That means that as the demand for energy goes up, and the guidelines that the EPA has imposed for our new, um, you know, <laughs> environmental endeavors to try to reduce emissions, that's going to be encroaching on some of the sectors that produce electricity and the byproducts, uh, which the EPA has decided are a little too high in particulate count. So it's going to be closing some of our much needed infrastructure, which means and it's all the more important for you to make your purchasing decisions now while the market is coincidentally also at all-time lows and protect yourself. Uh, you don't have to shop your contract now. You can wait. There are many people who follow that philosophy and it is called riding the market. But in my opinion, energy rates are slow, so low right now, especially uh, for natural gas and electricity, is lower than it's been in many years, although really the very best time to lock your contract was um, in the last two years. It's gone up a little bit. It's going to keep going up. So if you haven't made decisions about how you're going to be purchasing your power for the next couple of years and you have questions, I know it's very scary. People don't like to be in contracts because they typically feel like it limits their options, but in this marketplace right now, it really is the safest thing for you to do to make sure you don't have um, unexpected bills coming in. This is a, a budget item you can fix and account for, and the shoulder months are the perfect time to do it. Um, do it before we have another storm. Weather is very closely tied to energy rates. So that's my two cents, and I hope it helps.